Hi diaper wearers. In this video, we test a special diaper that has never been seen before, the Foresight Mary Jane. Some of you will probably be able to guess what this alludes to. Mary Jane is a slang word for marijuana or cannabis. In Germany, legalization has been discussed for years. The traffic light government promised it, but even a year and a half after the government was formed, things look pretty bleak. There hasn't even been any decriminalization yet, so cannabis is still legally banned. Although the plan is being pursued, it was after all one of the few issues that the three parties were able to agree on quickly. But it will probably take at least until 2024 before that happens. Already, however, there is a matching diaper that has been printed with hemp leaves in different colors instead of childlike motifs. And that over the entire surface, front, back, between the legs and even on the sides. The prints look quite contrasty, not comparable to Pampers, but much higher quality. The diaper is supposed to be similar to Foresight under the sea, I find it feels more comfortable. The outer film seems softer and goes in the direction of the classic diapers, when they were all outside with film instead of textile-like material. That hasn't been around for a long time, I didn't live through that time, even when I was a kid, there were those with cotton long ago. Nowadays you can only find them with ABDL diapers, as there are many who prefer foil. I had made a survey about this and the result was quite clear. Many of you can therefore look forward to the outer material of the Mary Jane. It is glued with resealable plastic glue, so there is an adhesive area in the front. It is not designed differently, but only thicker plastic has been glued on, so that the adhesives can be removed there again without destroying the foil. These adhesives are standard on many ABDL diapers and work well, you can easily reopen and re-stick them multiple times. In terms of suction performance, it has shown no weaknesses, several loads are no problem and are well distributed in the diaper, as always, however, you have to pay attention to the right size and fit, otherwise it can also happen that something runs out especially on the legs. This I had once when it was not tight enough. Even if the fit in the diaper is not optimal, Something like this can happen, especially with the boys and men. It took a surprisingly long time for it to start leaking with a good fit. It held over 1.7 kilograms, so up to about 1.5 kilos shouldn't be a problem. I was somewhat surprised by the high weight of 230 grams of an empty diaper. You still feel well wrapped, but not so extremely thick, so I would have estimated it lighter. I bought them for 22 euros and 90 cents per pack, which makes a unit price of 2.29 euros per diaper with 10 pieces of content. No bargain, but for this niche I find the price acceptable. I think it should be clear that this is not at all about developing the thickest diaper with the highest absorbency, or something similar. For this there are already quite a few, of which I already had a few in the test. For example, the 9.5 liter diaper, or if it should be printed, the Critter Carboose. The special feature of the diaper is the design with the cannabis leaves. Those who like this plant and like to wear or need to wear diapers will certainly be happy about this, it's the first one I've seen that brings these two things together. Probably just because it's a niche within a niche. ABDL diapers with childish motifs have a wider target audience, this one is pretty specific after all. Still, there are likely to be some who are interested. In 2021, 4.5 million adults aged 18 and older used cannabis at least once in the previous 12 months. One can speculate how many of those are wearing diapers, it will certainly be a small fraction, but the niche is there. Qualitatively, I have nothing to criticize about the Mary Jane, it feels good, is equipped with high-quality adhesives that can be reopened and closed. The suction is not extremely high, but is still in the upper range, so you can make a few times pure. Strong colors were also used for the imprints, which do not look worse in real than in the pictures or packaging. I personally find it good that the background was kept in white, which also creates a great contrast. To what extent you like the imprints, this diaper certainly depends even more on your own taste than it does anyway with such optical issues. I think who does not have at least a sympathy for cannabis, which will like these motifs rather less. But that's not a problem. There is a huge selection of different ABDL diapers. Surely everyone will find at least one that he likes visually. Or you take a white one, if it is more about the function, less about the optics. They are also usually a bit cheaper than the printed ones. For this target group I would recommend the diaper, so all who have a certain sympathy for cannabis, or who maybe just like the distinctive leaf. You don't necessarily have to associate it with a drug. Maybe someone who likes nature and likes tree leaves, for example, will find these prints nice as well. 
certain similarity with the maple they have. For those who do not like all this, it is a good diaper at a still acceptable price, but in that case, you might consider whether an alternative might not be more suitable, which can withstand a little more for a small extra charge, for example. This can be, but of course it doesn't have to be, if for example you can't or don't want to wear the diaper for that long anyway. If this one is not for you, feel free to check out the other videos on my channel. I have already tested some diapers there. There are various, from more or less heavily printed on white, medical diapers and also a few smaller for children and adolescents. I'm sure you'll find another one there that you like better. Even if you didn't like this diaper so much, maybe you found my video interesting? Then I would be happy if you give a thumbs up and maybe even subscribe to the channel. Subscribing costs nothing and you'll get a notification from YouTube when I upload new videos when you press the bell, so you won't miss diaper tests or other new content related to diapers. Thanks for watching, I hope you all stay dry and don't leak. See you next video.